kind of daunting to come to the big TT. It's such a massive thing. But for you guys, you got so so many mates and so so much family around you. Yeah, yeah. we've got some right, of the most experienced it, riders. Yeah, possible yeah. as family members. So yeah, I know. You, you can't really beat that for so taking guys, advice off the right people. So you guys, like you know, during during the whole fortnight now, that's your life, right? And you're going to be there. Oh yeah. Uh, discussing when you're not out there. Getting, you're going to be on the bike, right? You're going to be tweaking it. You're going to be t discussing it. You know, you're going to take your little rest in between and all that kind of yeah. stuff as much as you can. Yeah. But your mind's going to be, yeah, it's just focused in yeah. all the time. Yeah. You know, yeah. right? Yeah, that's the plan. Yeah, yeah. yeah. And so, uh, you know, coming the new year now, and yeah. And so in 2022, the bike what my dad rode at the TT was a uh, the first new generation of CES bikes yeah. um, the Christie boys and the dad Simon Simon's been building bikes for years 30 plus years but now the his lads Sam, Tom and Adam have started building their own bikes with Simon still involved um, and it's a new generation of CES bike and my dad had the first one that they've built as a family and they've done everything from manufacturing the wiring looms, Tom rebuilds engines, they do a fantastic job between them Um and he did really well. Dad got two top ten finishes, almost 110 mile an hour, just short, which he'll be gutted about. Um, and then after the TT, that's the bike I rode. So got to grips with that. And at the end of the year, um, the Christie boys have had a, a few orders of bikes for 2023. Mm -hmm. um, and there was a, I think they had a call from Australia asking for a bike out there. The mm -hmm. problem with Australia was getting it built and shipped out in time for their racing season, it'd be a bit tight. So came to a deal where we'd sell our bike to Australia and the Christie boys would build us another another one. Oh, so oh, a little bit. That we've, yeah. we've got a few little tweaks, what I prefer <laughs> personally. Oh. So, so we're gonna get slightly mod modified to how I want the bike, a few tweaks, but it's basically gonna be their fourth bike, I think, by the time it's ready. Um, and that's the bike we're going to go into 2023 with. Oh, well, that's great because we here we are. You know, you know, I'm going to help, you know, build the sport by getting yeah. the publicity out there, right? 100%. And we get you guys, you know, the the, the Christies and all these. It'd be great to see them uh, have a really uh, fantastic um, business going there, right? Yeah. They do a yeah. great product. They, they do, and they go with that. Yeah. You know, like you say, it's great to see coming around. You know, sending shifting these out to other parts of the world. That's it, that's it, we need to spread it everywhere yeah. really, so it's um, it's going in the right direction and as some of the older chassis builders are moving on and retiring from building, we need the new chassis builders coming through so they're doing a good job of yeah. filling a bit of the gap. Oh yeah, well that's great.